One of the reasons that I'm so excited about being with HDO is because of all of the different kinds of teaching I enjoy doing. I teach tiny graduate seminars for PhD students in international studies. I teach huge undergraduate lecture classes. But there's something about the opportunity to teach in HDO that's remarkable. We connect with people who are themselves professionals, but who in the midst of uh, demanding, exciting and important careers, make the decision that they want to join us in the classroom. All my life I've been in the academy, but I think it's only really with the HDO students that I've acquired a full sense of the reciprocity of teaching. Taking content I care about and enjoy presenting and working on in multiple contexts, and making it the basis of a conversation between, not at, but between myself and the individuals I'm fortunate enough to join with. The decision to come back to school, as they say, to pursue an additional advanced degree, I think is always related to there being much that you've accomplished and still things that you want to do. Enrolling in the HDO program means that you will take classes across disciplines and fields. You will hone an original research project that will be mentored and responded to by two faculty members. And that capstone will be something that, at the minimum, will clarify your thoughts about where you are personally and professionally, and that's quite a lot to achieve to begin with, and at maximum will have perhaps impact the organization for which you currently work, allow you to imagine it and or somewhere else in ever more resourceful and productive ways. I have great admiration for people who do specialized professional degrees, whether in business or in any other professional school. But I am fundamentally committed to the fact that advanced work on what it means to be a human being from an interdisciplinary liberal arts perspective is the best way of interacting with other human beings in whatever organizational, social, or institutional context you find yourself. So I continue to participate in it out of personal pleasure, the chance to work with these great students and with my fine colleagues from across the campus, but also because I simply see our field, the shared social sciences and humanities as essential to understanding what human beings have been, are currently, and how we might be our best selves in the future.